up y'all how's everybody doing how's everything going so um today i wanted to show y'all something because i just got decided to order some um i'm hoping that's what this is i ordered some stockings like two stockings for my granddaughter for christmas um because only two of my grandkids will be here for Christmas. And um, both of them are girls. And I wanted to get them some stockings to hang up. So I wanted to fill their stockings up. Now, one of them is 10, just turned 10 last month. And the other one is 12. Now, my the 10 year old, She's not into really. She's not really into the Barbie dolls and stuff like that. She do the Robux or whatever that is. I don't know. It's some stuff. Something on on um on her game or whatever. She buys she buys stuff for the game. I guess it's. I don't. I really don't understand. I really don't understand. <laughs> I really don't understand what it is that that these games do or what it's about or whatever. All I know is she's always asking for Robux or whatever. So that's what that is. But either way, I went and I ordered from Amazon two stockings for them. I hope this is big enough. It said 18 inches or what have you. But I'm hoping it's big enough so I can stuff them. I'm going to show y'all. Oh, it's three of them. Oh, okay. Oh. Nah, these ain't big enough. Oh, man. These are not big enough. But anyway, this is this is one. Isn't that cute? That's one of them. And then, this is the other one. Reindeer. I honestly only need two, but it came three. And this here is the Santa Claus one. I like these 3D type of um, stockings. But it's messed up because what I have, I don't believe is going to fit in these. I'm going to try because I don't already bought them. But I really don't think that the stuff is going to fit in these. Ugh! Anyway. Not. So, one of the things I got is some Uno cards. This is for the 12-year-old. She... They, they both are really into like Uno and stuff like that, but you know, being that everything is emoji now, so I got the older one, the one with the emoji. Let me show y'all. I'll be right back. Let me show y'all the rest of what I got. And these are stocking stuffers, y'all. So. Like I said, the 12-year-old has the emojis, and the 10-year-old has the Super Mario uh, Uno cards. That's those. Woo! These are mine, y'all. Delicious. Man, when I seen them, I had to get, I went, I got two, two boxes. But I love those. All right, so... Okay, one of them, the, my 10 year old, she has, she's into slime. She's been into slime since she was about five. So this is for her. Um, I'm, you know what? I'm, I'm either going to have to take these out and individually just put them in the bag that I'm stocking because there's no way I'm going to be able to get this big thing in them stocking. Now, the only thing I could do is order some more stockings, the really, really huge stockings. 
And I might, I might have to wind up doing that. I don't want to because I don't spend money on these, but I, I could kind of figure out, you know, or hold these till next year, or I can use these for like, um, me and my husband, you know, little things to give each other. I don't know. I'll figure something out, but I might have to because I really want to stuff their stockings, and those are nowhere near big enough. But anyway. This is uh, my 10 year old granddaughter's hustle line. And so, then I got these here to stuff it in. These here is popcorn with uh, Butterfinger crunched up in them. So, <clears throat> I remember my granddaughter saying she loved these, so I wanted to get that in for her. And we have some more. This is um, Sour Patch popcorn, candy popcorn. And we have Oreos popcorn. And then Chips Ahoy. So I bought four bags. So I'm going to separate them. And I'm going to give them both two bags and put it and stuff it in there for them. All right, so now this here is for my 12-year-old granddaughter. You know, my my daughter said that my granddaughter's into perfume and little makeup. You know, she don't wear makeup outside, naturally, because she's only 12. But when she's home, she likes to play in makeup and, you know, fix her hair and stuff like that. And she's like into, you know, perfume, smelling good. My daughter said that she's always coming in her room saying, Mommy, could you put some perfume on me? So I got her her own little set, you know, comes with lotion, perfume, and then a sampler to take. Like if she's out for the day, she could spray herself a little bit. So I got her that. <clears throat> And um, I got her, what is this? Um, oh, lip balm. I got her some lip balm. And this is a little case to carry it in, you know. So when she's out, you know, cold weather, her lips get dry. She got the lip balm for that. Let's see. Oh, I also I got her some nails. But she's she's into she's been into that. Okay, let me show you. Like my younger granddaughter, she's not really into nails like that. She don't even like going to get her nails done. So I got her a bunch of these. I love that color. Those colors. This hair. I'm pretty sure she's gonna love these nails. Put them on. She's gonna enjoy putting them on and stuff like that. Let's see. I really like these. It's, it's, it's hard to see because the reflection. But anyway, this is yeah, that's how it looks. And and I also got these here for her. So, I got those. So, she got four packs. Unless, unless I um, got some more in here, I believe that was it, four packs. And then, I also got her, um, what is this called? Well, it's basically a nail kit set to where, you know, she can... Um, sand down her nails and, and um, brush them and you know the thing that go that they use in the salon thing to go between the toes so when she paint her toenails the, the toenails won't mush together and mess them up then she has a scrubbing thing for her the bottom of her feet to keep her feet nice and smooth and then she has a buffer and a nail file and stuff like that and a brush this brush up here you know, that's all right. So she can learn how to um, 
keep herself groomed and stuff like that. You know, her feet, keep her feet nice. And also, I got her this little mirror. It lights up, LED. You know, it's a nice little heart mirror. So when she's in the, when she's in her room and she's planning her makeup and stuff like that, she can, um, you know, she can work on her skills, her makeup skills. By the time she gets to be 16, she'll really know how to apply her makeup. You know, so she has her own little personal mirror. And, and uh, this is my... Um, I don't know if this, I think this is, oh, this is my younger granddaughter's, just in case she decides that she want to do her nails, there's a, um, nail polish, and, um, this here is one of those, um, things that they have at the salon, it dries your nails, um, when you get your nails done, you put your nail, your hands on under there and it's like UV rays and it dries your nails and then it's little like little stickers here that you could put on the nails to fancy it up. I don't see if y'all can see that up close. Yeah, so that's hers. That's my youngest granddaughter, the 10-year-old. And okay, this one same thing, just you know got teenagers on here. Uh, the exact same thing, but this is for the 12 year old. You know, with the UV rays and stuff like that. Um, this here is for my 12 year old. She, this is lip gloss, different color lip gloss. It's not lipstick y'all, it's lip gloss. So it's gonna give off a slight color, but not to the point where it looks like she's trying to be grown so that's for her and um this is for my 10 year old granddaughter or extra nail polish and stuff like that so that's it and let's see this here is for my 12-year-old granddaughter, you know, to keep her nails nice, following them down, an electric filer to keep her nails nice. So that's hers. And also, for the 12-year-old, she has a little makeup brush, you know, so she could apply the little makeup and stuff like that. Okay, she do. I did get her extra nail, so yeah, I found them. That's cute, right? The little polka dots, different color polka dots all over. That's nice. So that's her. So she actually have five packs of nails. And um, I got her also some sponges apply her makeup you know little girls you know when I was younger uh, I played in my mother's makeup all the time all the time um, and my sisters did too so I you know I know how it is to be a little girl and, and you want to play in makeup and you know because you, you you watch TV you see the girls wearing makeup the teenage girls these little teenage shows and the girls are wearing makeup and you know as as a, a young girl yourself you want you want to dip and dab in the makeup you know i think every young girl when they was when they was young had a little makeup kit when they was little you know little toy makeup kits y'all i'm i'm just finding nails all over the place here's another set Look at that. Isn't that cute? That's really cute. She's gonna, I believe she's gonna love these. I really do. Now, this here says beauty book, eye and face. This is 
my 12 year olds. You open it up and there's the little makeup in here, the shadow, highlighter, bronzer, blush, all of that right in here. And I like that it comes like, you know, it comes in a book, you know, close it up. I seen one that had a mirror in it, but my husband was like, it don't make sense to get her one with the mirror because we already got her LED heart shaped mirror. He said, so that'll take care of that. So I said, you know what? You're right. You're right. So I just got this. But I love the fact that it's, it's like a book. I love that. You can close it up and just put it, you can slip it up on your dresser and just, you know, close up. I like that. And this one here is for my 10-year-old granddaughter, little perfume. And um, I believe this is lip gloss yeah it's a little lip gloss a little lip gloss and a perfume it's a little more kiddish because she's only 10 she just turned 10 so she's gonna like that so so far that is all that i have um so i'm gonna have to get more stuff for my younger granddaughter because the majority of the stuff that I got is for my my 12 year old granddaughter so I'm gonna have to find I'm gonna have to find uh some more stuff for my younger granddaughter I gotta put I gotta put this stuff I, I want to separate this stuff so I know exactly whose stuff is what this is her. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to separate it this way. I know exactly who's stuff is who's and I don't have to be rambling through everything trying to see oh what did I get this one what did I get that one so everything will be separate and that'll be it so I'm not exactly sure how much more I'm gonna I don't know how much more I'm gonna get but I mean, this is a good start. I'm not, I'm not finished though. I'm not finished because there's a couple of more things that I want to get. But um, the store was closing. I wasn't finished. I didn't even, honestly, I didn't even get to really look around the store good. Cause when we got there, we got there ten minutes before they were closing. And they started yelling out, We're closing in 10 minutes, as soon as we walked in the door. It was like, honestly, it was like they seen us coming and was like, up, oh, up, oh, let's let them know. Because <laughs> they not sitting up in here. So they told us right away, as soon as we walked in the door, it was like, closing in 10 minutes. So me and my husband, we ran, ran around the store getting as much as we could before they closed up. But... And all all of the stuff that I that you that I just showed you came from far below. Only thing that didn't come from far below is the stockings. But everything else came from far below. So I think I, I think this is a pretty good a pretty good start as far as um, stocking stuff is. I'm glad that I don't have to, to, um, I don't have to do much. You know, I have, um, I have a, a grandson that's, what, 17, 18, 17. But uh, he has a job, so he told us not to get him anything. His mother said the same thing. Um, don't get him nothing because he has a job and, um, 
you know, he doesn't need anything. He has everything you want. He has games and all this and that. Plus, he's older, so he's not really looking for gifts like that. You know, he's just worried about getting his girlfriend something, so. So, that saved us for him. And then my other two grandsons, um, we're not getting them anything either because they have so much toys. And um, my son had already said that they have more than enough toys. And like the toys they do have, they really don't have no room for any more toys. You know, cause they we over the years we bought them some some um, really nice things and bulky things. So they were saying, you know, for us not to worry about them as far as toys is concerned, because they said they have enough stuff and they still they don't have room for the stuff that we bought them before. So. so you know, so that saved us up. So this year, all we have to do is worry about my two granddaughters. And I forgot. I don't forgot a whole thing of the putting it back. Anyway, so I think we got some, we got a good amount of stuff for these girls. I just want to, for my younger granddaughter, I just want to get a couple more things because my older granddaughter, she has a good amount of stuff as far as uh, stocking stuff. So, I want to make sure that my other granddaughter has a good amount of stuff also. You know, so, I just got to get I just got to go back to Five Below and see what else they have in there. And so I can finish stuffing these bags. Oh. Woo! All right, so that's that. And these stockings, I got to figure out something with these stockings. But I'm, I'm definitely going to have to get the... Um, I'm definitely going to have to get the really huge stockings because those those are not gonna do it. Those are there's no way I'm gonna be able to get that stuff in these bags. I might be able to get the only thing I think I'd be able to get in these stockings is maybe the nails. The packets of nails. Um that's about it. But other than that, it's nothing else is gonna fit in there. So I'm gonna have to go back online and order them the giant um stockings the one that go all the way down to the floor that's basically the size of like a five-year-old that high so i'm gonna have to get that y'all i'm over here i got me some tacos y'all about to bust it down because i am hungry i haven't had anything to eat today so ooh. I'm gonna have to. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to um bust these down because I am hungry. Anyway, y'all, that's it for today, y'all. I just wanted to show y'all um a few things that I've gotten to, for my granddaughters to put in their stockings. Um like I said before, there's a few more things I want to get to finish it up. But for the most part, um, yeah, that's good. Um, I think my husband is going to get um, my older granddaughter um, Nintendo Wii or um, the Switch, one of those, and put them in there also. Um, and my younger granddaughter, she already has games and stuff like that so it's it'll be I, I think what i'm gonna do is honestly i think i'm gonna 
get them a couple of pair of pajamas and a couple of outfits, maybe a one or two pair of sneakers to go with it. And, you know, when we were younger, my mother and them, they would stuff our stockings. And if they got us pajamas or clothes, they would lay our clothes across the couch, you know, and um, put the sneakers right up under there, right up under the clothes. And then they would lay the pants or the skirts and then the shirt on top of them. And then next to it would be our stockings just stuffed up. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna stuff the stockings, lay out their pajamas and lay out their clothes and, and stuff like that. And just let them get up and, you know, do what they do. They're 10 and 11, they still believe in Santa Claus. So, um, that's a beautiful thing that they still believe in Santa Claus at, the, at that age. But, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's it. I'm just gonna get them a couple of more things, like I said couple of more outfits I'll probably go to either Target or Walmart and get them the pajamas the, and a um, couple of outfits and stuff like that and my my 12 year old granddaughter she's coming her and my older daughter she they're coming from Georgia because they live in Atlanta and they'll be here on the 20th and they're gonna stay for the rest of that week and so it'll be good for all of them to be here for them to wake up in the morning together because they have not done that um, ever. So, because when my granddaughter was born, my 12 year old granddaughter was born, she was born in Atlanta. And she has only been here maybe twice her whole life. So she didn't, she never got to wake up with us, her grandparents. She's never got to wake up with us on Christmas and stuff like that because they couldn't come here because of my daughter's job. We couldn't come there because of my husband's job. So we would see, you know, we would see each other like once in a blue moon. If my husband got time off, we would just go out there. Or when she had birthday parties, we would fly out there to see them. But she's never been here and stayed with us. So this is going to be really nice. But anyway, I showed y'all everything that I have. Um, when I get the rest of the stuff, I will show y'all what I, what I bought, but this was nice and I'm going to sit and eat my tacos cause I am starving. So like I said before, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, share with your friends, comment below, tell me what you think of the stuff that I bought and, um, let me know, is there anything that y'all suggest that I could add to the stockings that I didn't show y'all, didn't, that I didn't think of? And, you know, let me know. But until then, I'll talk to y'all later. Be blessed. Stay blessed, y'all. I'm going to eat. And peace.